Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another exciting edition of our Game Development Diary. Update 13 brings a plethora of fantastic news for you. From the introduction of a new vehicle that you can call your own, to map enhancements, a revamped car modification system, sound improvements and much more. Stick around till the end to catch all the latest updates. But before we dive in, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. First up on our list is the addition of the brand new Macava model. Say goodbye to the old car model as it makes way for this sleeker and more precise beauty. Every detail on the exterior has been meticulously crafted from the taillights to the overall aesthetics. Moreover, the simple old interior has been upgraded to a more sophisticated and interactive design, making your gameplay experience much more immersive. You may have seen the Macaba as a taxi before, but now you can make it yours. Introducing the car dealership in Coxfield, where you can walk in and purchase your very own Macaba car. Not only can you buy it, but you can also fully customize its body, paint and performance. Stay tuned for future updates as more cars and additional body parts for the Macaba will be available in the dealership. One super cool addition to this version of the game is the car decal system. Head over to Elijah's car shop and browse through a variety of decals for all your vehicles. You can now adorn your ride with up to six different decals, depending on the vehicle's body parts. Share your thoughts in the comments section below on what decals you'd like to see in future updates. Plus, with this new system, Decals on the Macava Taxi are now actual decals and not baked into a texture as before. Just a technical fun fact. Moving on, we've also enhanced the map functionality. Navigation is now smoother, with improved panning and zooming controls for a more responsive experience. But the real game changer is the ability to pin locations to the minimap. Simply click on a spot and voila! The location appears on the edge of the minimap, guiding you effortlessly. And fear not, this feature will only expand in the future with custom waypoints on arbitrary map locations. Last but certainly not least, let's talk about the radio. We've implemented an FMOD transceiver system for seamless synchronization of multiple sound sources on radio stations. This means that music now emanates realistically from speakers, enhancing immersion. Say goodbye to awkward pauses between songs as they now crossfade seamlessly. Plus, the Anchorman's commentary will no longer interrupt your jam sessions midway through a song, making for a more natural radio experience. And that's a wrap on all the major features for this version. Of course, there were a few minor tweaks and changes made as well. As always, you can find the full list on our Steam post. If you haven't already, be sure to check out Turbo Chicken Simulator on Steam. Thank you so much for tuning in. And until next time, keep those feathers flying.